In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the McAfee ESM integration with ThreatQ. There are two parts to the integration. These are population of ESM watch lists with data from TQ for use in alarms or other preferred correlation techniques, and creation of events in TQ when a correlation occurs in ESM using relevant threat data. We start with the transfer of data from TQ to ESM. Firstly, we define an advanced search that contains the data that we want to send to ESM. In this case, I am transferring IP, MD5 and FQDNs. This is then saved and the integration configured with the name of the search. Searches may be customized to include more specific criteria such as score, status and source. Now once this data and report has been configured, a scheduled task will regularly connect to ThreatQ, run and capture the latest results of the saved search, and then transfer it over to our ESM interface. In ESM, the results are passed into watch lists. There is a separate watch list for each indicator type. This data may be used for alarm or correlation purposes. In this example, we have configured an alarm, <clears throat> and this alarm uses the IP watch list as its reference point. So here you can see the ThreatQ correlation alarm. If we look at the normalized dashboard, we can see an example of this alarm triggering. See this here. We have a dedicated event and a notification at the top right that the alarm has actually occurred. In this system, a triggered alarm will generate an event in ThreatQ. The ThreatQ event, as per this example, contains attributes that describe the event, including in this case a TCP denied message. It also contains a brief description and a list of the related indicators. If we click on one of these indicators, we can see more details And we can also perform initial triage and deeper investigation if required. In this case, we can see that the indicator has been seen by three sources, the adversary reader, digital shadows intelligence, and the McAfee ESM integration. Furthermore, our scoring system has been configured to identify and prioritize these types of event. And so this IP address has been increased to a score of 10 in this case. As we look further into the indicator details, we can also see that we have related adversary information. All of this is you can click on and drill down into. We have related event information. Again, we can click on and drill down into. TTP information, related indicators. In addition, operations are available for further enrichment by, if required by the analyst or investigative team. In this video, you've seen an integration between ThreatQ and McAfee ESM. The integration makes good use of the bidirectional capabilities of the open exchange. In turn, this delivers a more feature-rich experience to analysts for triage, analysis, and deeper investigations.